PrimeTex is a revolutionary new product where we spread carbon fabric after it's woven, which allows us to use larger K fibers to make lighter weight fabrics. What this does is it creates a lower cost fabric at an equivalent weight to a more expensive fabric. While it's in the BMW M6 roof, it's in a Fisher skis, it's being used quite widely in aerospace now in satellites where we can take very high modulus fibers and make lightweight fabrics that are more cost effective. It allows us to weave fabrics that could not ordinarily be woven at a more standard weight. Well, the whole reason we use carbon fiber and carbon fabric is to reduce weight. And the more we can reduce the weight, the more the customer can save, for instance, fuel for an airliner, fuel in a car, possibly a lighter weight bicycle. All these things, weight is important. So by reducing the weight of the fabric, we can reduce the weight of the product. Well, the other benefit of Primetex is taking a standard fabric and spreading the fiber so that it completely closes it up. It makes each individual yarn equal in width and it gives a much uh, more perfect appearance than the standard woven fabric. We're gonna continue to develop this product to achieve lighter and lighter weight fabrics as we uh, promote our IM8 and IM10 fibers. This process is key in being able to weave those into a usable fabric. In addition to approving the cosmetics and reducing weight, it will also reduce the crimp of the fabric, which will increase the mechanical performance of the fabric. We're finding that in a lot of our resin systems that we get enhanced mechanical properties by using this process. Here at the JEC event in Boston, you know, we're really looking to promote our high strength and intermediate modulus and high modulus fibers. Fibers such as IM7, which is industry known legacy product, but also you know, where we're going in our development with uh, the world's highest strength fiber, which is IM10, which is commercialized today, produced out of Salt Lake City. And then our high modulus platform, which we've uh, recently launched and uh, promoted earlier this year, also out of Salt Lake City, 63 million modulus fibers. And then also what we're doing with our industrial strategy and you know, fibers and programs where we haven't always been present and how we're trying to bridge that gap and develop some, you know, really world-leading fibers, you know, with fibers such as IM2, which there's really not a spot in the industry for today. 40 to 43 MSI fiber, 800 KSI plus. So we're really excited about, you know, where we're going in our development and our uh, production. You know, we're going to invest very aggressively over the, uh, the next five years and uh, you'll see a lot of growth in our capacity in Salt Lake City and uh, rest of the world. IM10 right now, it's a, you know, for strength driven applications such as weight critical pressure vessels, very high performance burst strength, but where you need to drive the weight down where it's, you know, cost critical and every pound um, saved on these platforms is, uh, is, is a lot of money. So IM10 is going to, it's a million plus PSI fiber, you know, it is the world's strongest fiber today. I, I think you're going to see a lot of exciting things from Hexel carbon fibers in, in, uh, in the coming years and, you know, near term and, and medium term. So we're really excited about where we're going with you know, high strength, high modulus uh, fibers in the future and really developing, continuing to develop you know, world leading fibers that, uh, that really to change the landscape of composites. Hexcel is promoting a new line of industrial carbon prepregs. We're offering these products at very competitive pricing, lead time, and with very small minimum order quantities. These products come as a 200 GSM plain weave and 2x2 twill construction with a cosmetic 3K fiber. We also have a 670 GSM fabric, very conformable, and um, they come with a very versatile resin system, 250F cure system. It can be cured out of autoclave, compression molding, different processing conditions. So we're producing these products to stock in our Windsor, Colorado facility. We have them available at a four to eight week lead time and we also make them at a 50 yard roll quantity. So that becomes very easy for two operators to handle these materials. They've got a great 
out life of six weeks at room temperature. Hexcel's really excited to be offering these standard products. And we're looking to expand the product range to other products that our customers will need. This is a wheel cover made by our customer using three layers of our prepreg. There's a layer of the 200 GSM 2x2 two two twill construction on each side with the 670 2x2 two two twill construction on the inside. This is a steering wheel for high-end motorsport application and our customer produced this using both of our 200 GSM and 670 GSM 2x2 two two twill constructions. And they commented about the conformability was great for this particular application where there's highly contour radii. This is an air duct, again for a motorsport application, and this part really demonstrates the high conformability of our prepregs as well as the ability to achieve a great cosmetic finish.